Queen heartbreak, Prince Charles Fox Regency fears, can't expect her to continue. Queen Elizabeth II has been stepping aside and giving Prince Charles more responsibilities amid speculation that she could take early retirement. The Queen, 94, became the longest reigning British monarch in 2015 as she surpassed the reign of her great-great-grandmother Victoria. But royal experts are beginning to question whether she will abdicate and pass the throne on to Prince Charles 71. Royal editor Robert Jobson explained how the Prince of Wales has been doing a lot of the heavy lifting the past few years as the Queen can't be expected to continue at the same pace. Speaking to Sky News, Mr. Jobson said, He is certainly the longest serving heir to the throne. I'm sure he will continue to do so if the Queen wants to continue in that role. I'm sure there is enough scope if she wanted to step aside for him to become Prince Edrington and that she can enjoy her retirement like the Duke of Edinburgh has from the age of 96 if she wants to. But otherwise, in the Prince of Wales' transition over the past 10 to 15 years, he has been taking on more of the responsibilities of the Queen. He does most of the heavy lifting in terms of long-haul flights representing the Queen and is supported by Prince William and Duchess of Cambridge as well. I think there has been a transition and you can't expect Her Majesty to continue at the same pace as she has the last 86 years. Whether there is a formal handing over of that executive power in terms of a regency is still up in the air, but the Prince of Wales will obviously continue to do more and more. Royal biographer Angela Levin believes the Queen could step down as early as next year. She told Channel 5 documentary The Queen and Charles, Mother and Son, the monarch could step down from the duties at 95. The documentary's narrator, Stefan Greaves, said, Some royal experts think the Queen's age may eventually force her to step down from her day-to-day -day duties as monarch. Charles could become Prince Regent, King in all but name. Ms. Levin added, if the monarch is incapable of doing her duties, then the heir can take over and do all the duties the monarch can't do. There were much rumors that Queen might stand down as when she's 95, but actually she seems so strong and confident she might just carry on. But Mr. Anne Whitelock, a royal historian, said, there is much speculation that the Queen might one day have to abdicate. I think there is no chance of the Queen abdicating.